When will these people learn not to piss off the gods? Okay, the story of Niobe is very short, and like most Greek tragedies, is an essay on the folly of hubris. But for context, we're gonna need the story of Leto and her twin children, Artemis and Apollo. Yeah, you already know who they are, but their mom is more important in this story, so bear with me. So way back when, the goddess Leto had a fling with Zeus and got pregnant. Hera obviously objected, but because she couldn't do her normal solution and kill Leto, she instead decided to make her life really hard. So she put out some rules. Leto could totally give birth, she just couldn't do it on the mainland, on an island, or anywhere under the sun. And apparently Olympus counted too? Whatever. So Leto found this tiny bear rock called Delos, which wasn't the mainland and didn't count as an island, and set up to give birth. Some versions also say that Hera kidnapped Alethea, the goddess of childbirth, to keep Leto from having her kids, but any mother will tell you that nothing stops the baby when it wants to get out, so Leto had her children anyway. First Artemis, and then nine days later, Apollo. So now that we've got some backstory, let's talk about Niobe. So Niobe, queen of Thebes, has a loving husband, Amphion, and fourteen children, seven sons and seven daughters. Life is pretty sweet. Now Leto has a temple in Thebes, and she's requested that the women of Thebes pay her some respect via incense, pretty much standard godly fare. Well, Niobe shows up to do her thing and apparently decides that the best way to worship Leto is to try and one-up her. So Niobe claims that, hey, she managed to have 14 kids while Leto only had two, so who's the real goddess? Well, evidently Leto, as the minute she hears that particular gem, she calls up the twins and asks him to show Niobe who's boss. So Arnorus and Apollo gear up and start sniping Niobe's kids, killing all of them. Then her husband kills himself. Sucks to be you, Niobe. Sounds like your mouth was writing checks your nuclear family couldn't cash. Then she turns into a rock. The end. I won't disturb the slumber of feelings that have died. If I never loved, I never would have cried.